your soul attracted a shorter haircut than what you wanted in order for this emotion to be triggered. Does that make sense? Now you can choose to get into it, cry. How many of you have had that? A haircut that you didn't want and you're really upset? A lot of the women have that. That's great. Allow yourself to connect to that emotionally. And if you connect to that emotionally, you'll find all sorts of issues about unworthiness and lots of very, very core issues. Just driving here, it's like, oh, well, yeah. even not thinking that it's related to hair. That's right. And a lot of times it might not be related to the actual hair. And this is the problem with going through the, the issue intellectually, is that you'll come up with a lot of intellectual ideas. But in the end, it might not be the real cause of the law of attraction emotion. So the key is to always go into the emotion, because it's the emotion that created the law of attraction. Does that make sense to everyone? Yes. Emotion. And it's, yeah, it's, well, a lot of times the emotion is just right there on the surface, but we don't allow ourselves to connect to it. And that's the problem, that we have the emotion is being triggered, but we're trying to shut it down at the same time through judgment or something else, trying to shut it down. The key is to allow it to be triggered right at that moment. That is the best time to allow it. So how many of you know there was an emotion triggered sometime when you're at work and you decided you'll put it off to that evening? And then what happens that evening? I can't even remember it sometimes. Or, or what, ha what happens sometimes is uh, I can remember it, but people hope if I can feel it now. you know. And so this is the thing we need to learn to allow yourself to feel it in the moment that it happens rather than putting it off and putting it off to some other time.